A typical day for me, Haldeman would pick me up around 7.15. He, the car would get Bob, then it would get Larry Higby, Bob's aide, and then it would swing by my house and they'd enter the White House. I am responsible for the scheduling and also for the president's daily activities. Our thing was a machine and I knew my place. It really reflected a lot about Richard Nixon, the degree to which he wanted things controlled. It literally was from 6 o'clock in the morning until 9 o'clock at night, every day of the week, and Saturdays and Sundays, too. And that pace was unremitting, totally consuming for somebody like me. I was very tough on people feeling that I had to be. There's something about the presidency that I've been ridiculed for my picking up the Navy term of zero defects, but you do have to operate at as close to zero defect as you can. And I was not overly concerned with whether people liked me as a result of it or not. I was only concerned that the result the president wanted got carried out.